the student union in the heart of the University at Buffalo. It's The Tonight Show, presenting the Sustainability Dashboard, starring Jimmy Fallon. Woo! Tonight Show features Scott Weber, Ken Shockley, slow jamming the news, catchphrase, and a special musical guest. And now, here is your host, Jimmy Fallon! <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you very much. It's great to be in Buffalo. <laughs> now, I know a lot of you have been trying to get me and my buddy Justin Timberlake here after he ditched you for me. But uh, let's be honest here. Who really brought the sexy back, right? You right? Did, Am Jimmy, I right? You brought it. <laughs> Well, uh, it's Earth Day, a day when we celebrate the planet we've been continuously deteriorating for hundreds of years. The only thing I've seen deteriorate that fast were the Buffalo Bills playoff chances. Uh, Ooh, yeah. got him. Uh, <laughs> but uh, today, we're at the University at Buffalo. You've spent 40 plus years trying to make the campus a better place for students and the region. Now, that's pretty awesome. But uh, I also have been trying to make the planet better for 39 years, so don't be too boastful. Whoa, Jimmy, don't you mean 21, right? Oh, right, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, 21 years. Uh, Hold on. <laughs> Wait a second. Jimmy, did you, did you fly here today? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did. Ah, oh, Jimmy, you're doing it all wrong. It's Earth Day. <laughs> if you're going to bust Ubi's chops, you've got to at least do it like me. More like you? Yeah, be more like me. I didn't fly here. I hopped on a social bicycle, just like the ones they have over here, uh -uh. very nice, <laughs> and rode as far as I could, and then I jumped on a kayak and came the rest of the way on the Erie Canal. Guilt-free travel. Well, we can't all be as good as you, Higgins. <laughs> I'm well, uh, as I was walking over here, I was almost blown back to New York by the wind. By the wind. You guys need wind turbines everywhere yeah, right now. Yeah, get the wind turbines. <laughs> Woo! And uh, well, talking about this crazy weather, how about this past winter? I think the only ones who were pleased with it were the people at uh, Schusmeisters. What, Jimmy? What, what is Schusmeisters? Oh, uh, I, I think it's uh, I think it's a German folk song, right? I, I think yeah, I, the Schussmeister. Right, uh, the Schussmeister. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. we good. go skiing down the slopes. Yeah, the ski. I think that's more. That was more that's, Swedish. That's Swedish. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's know. Swedish. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't. Still don't know. What <laughs> yeah. <it is>. Well, <laughs> after last winter's lack of uh, snow, I heard they were looking into other options, uh, like uh, skiing down the solar panels at the Strand. Well, uh, our uh, UB Falcons are back. Yeah. <laughs> our, our, our Falcons, not, yeah. not, not dying cats. We're, well, uh, yeah. that's, that's what I got uh, for no, you. That's no, they ask now. that you only view the cameras between the hours of 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. After that, they've been known to shut it off for privacy reasons. Well, because they got a lot of studying to do? Uh, well, when one falcon loves another falcon... Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, enough about me. We've got a great program today, so uh, stick around. But first, some more on uh, UB sustainability efforts. Outside of, of this community, not that many other people are thinking about where our stuff comes from and where it goes. And the mainstream media really focuses on just the relationship from the store to your house to the garbage can or recycling bin without even acknowledging that there is a whole life before and a whole life after. So I made this film, The Story of Stuff. We can reclaim and transform this linear system into something new, a system that doesn't waste resources or people. Really, we're here to ask a critical question that Annie has prompted us to think about, to explore, to ponder, to test. Do we want more or do we want better? We have a consumer muscle and a citizen muscle. Then that consumer muscle is spoken to and validated and nurtured so much that it is really well developed. But meanwhile, our citizen muscle has atrophied. We are not called upon to work together to engage as citizens for, for more systemic kind of change. She just helped me think about sustainability in a different way altogether. She made me think about the full process. It is so great to be here. I've had the most amazing day meeting so many of you. From the Sustainability Academy, I loved meeting the students and some of the faculty involved there. I met some great folks from the Environmental Alliance. 
Policy and citizenship is a big part of what we do. Several of our students are participating in improving the school lunches and advocating for improved school lunches and connecting farmers to schools. If you guys choose to get involved in these issues, if you choose a life of purpose rather than a life of stuff, then we will have every single thing we need to build a better future. So please join me, let's use our citizen muscles, recruit other people, and let's get this country back on path. Thank you so much.